Hi everybody, just thought I'd say hello. I know I haven't put a video up for a while, but I've been super busy at our new place doing all sorts of stuff, including my new water charger and toning and chanting chamber. <laughs> for a little over three months and instead of going to the gym I came out here and mixed cement and moved rocks a lot of my biggest rocks are in there there's probably close to 500 rocks in here so it's been a really amazing project but you probably some of you that follow me have heard me talk about water chargers I've shown them on previous videos You'll see I've got very special stones these green stones I've got lava stones giant lava stones from Hawaii and then I've got local stones I've got Mexican crystals I've got paver stones of different colors to shift the frequency so I have a wide variety of stones there you can see a great big crystal up there the crown is Mexican crystals and at the top it's rose quartz and uh, what happens is when the sunlight and the moonlight hits it and the environmental energies, such as the electricity in the air when it's stormy, but the sunlight, the moonlight, and the energy of the earth coupled with water excites each of the stones. The dark stones, like the lava, draw energy in like a sponge and then they sweat it out and then the crystals pump it out. So you get a pull, push, pull, push, yin, pull, yang, push. So if you know the nervous system, it acts like the nodes of Ranvier in the nervous system. And what it does is it creates a circular vortex. And inside the water charger, it actually is spinning and you can feel it inside of you quite strongly. In fact, it's pulsing really strongly like a giant heartbeat right now. So here you can see the stone floor Freddie and I built. That connects the whole water charger together and down on the bottom you see some very big stones and great big junk chunks of lava here you see these beautiful green stones which are almost like crystals they're very powerful they're tuned to the heart chakra so here you can see how as we went up i switched to paver stones so i can start shifting in and each level we go in about three or four inches and then we bridged it at the top to pull it together and then I'll place all my bottles, big uh, three gallon bottles of water. I'll fill it with water and just leave a little space for chanting and toning. You can see how the construction brings it up to a point and we capped it at the top. When we got it small enough that I could put a stone slab on top of it. And I will be putting a stone slab in the door that Penny and I just walked through. That'll connect the two halves of the charger, just like an electrical circuit, and make it much stronger. And we'll put as much water in here as we can. So when we're toning or chanting, we'll just sit on the water bottles, which will charge the water. And here you can see the size of some of these beautiful crystalline type stones and black stones I've got in here. And I stuff various crystals in here like right here and here's a black one and then somewhere I stuck a rose quartz but I can't remember where I stuck it but uh, there it is right there here's the rose quartz right here which is a real high frequency but once the door's on and it closes it'll it'll even be more like an echo chamber so you can imagine us being in here four five six eight of us going and that'll add to the charge of the water but due to the way it's constructed it creates a vortex that spins and the water molecules are sensitive enough to react 
So as the light from the sun and the moon hits it, it programs all the information and the environmental information coming even from the metabolism of the microorganisms, microorganisms and the animals in the air, anything that interacts with it from top to bottom, birds, squirrels, will actually be programmed into the water. So when you drink the water, it's like getting a real-time software update. So your body's in total harmony with the environment, the sun and the moon. I've been doing this for a number of years. I can't remember how many, probably 12 years. And it is a profound effect. And when the moon is full, the water gets so vital with energy, it bounces on your tongue like carbonated water. And when the moon is at new moon, the water is so empty energetically it feels like it goes right through your tongue like a solvent and is very good for detoxifying the body and it's full of yin energy so great for people that are overheated so that's a little trip to the water charger that's what i've been up to for the last three months and uh hope you enjoyed the little tour and we're having zen in the garden tomorrow so we're all excited we've got a full full class with uh, 45 people here at our new rainbow house so maybe someday you can come do a workshop with me here at the Rainbow. Hope you enjoyed seeing the water charger and I'll try to make some more videos for you along the way. Take care.